Before we give somebody a driver's license, they have to do something. They have to go through driver's ed. Now, could you imagine how awful the roads would be if we didn't have kids go through driver's ed? <laughs> Nobody would be safe. Literally, the streets would be barren because every parent would want to be hiding inside the house because there's a bunch of 16-year-olds driving around recklessly. No, they have to go through driver's ed so that they learn how to use this powerful tool, a car. In the same way, cell phones are powerful tools. We don't want to just carelessly toss a cell phone to our kid and say, happy birthday, you're 16, here you go. No, 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 no. We need to make sure that we have safeguards in place so that our children know how to effectively use this powerful tool that we have given them. So what are some of those safeguards that we can use? Well, there are web filters to make sure your kid isn't browsing on inappropriate sites. There are different apps that can monitor your child's use on social media platforms to make sure that they're not being a cyber bully or that they're not being cyber bullied. They can also protect your kid from social predators who are literally out there trying to find a way to destroy your kid's life. Parents, we can't just give our kids these tools and not train them in how to use them. No, 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 we have to equip our kids so that not only are they safe, but others are safe around them. Spend time with your kid on the phone. Look and see how is your kid utilizing the phone? What are the apps that they use? What are the programs that they're hitting on different social media sites? Check up on your kid. Make sure you have filters. Make sure you have all these things in place before you give your kid a phone. Make sure that your kid is safe and that their friends and those around them are safe as well so that you can be the parent your kid deserves.